And right now, you know, here in the U.S., 2020, it, it's a big year politically you know, with the, the presidential race. But it doesn't matter what side you're on. And I think it's funny, just as an aside, talking about sides, this, this idea of division, something that I covered in, in, in episode number 25, has digital divided us more? Just something to think about. And I know that there's a really big show right now on Netflix that is exploring the darker side of social media. But a lot of this, the rise of this division and, and really the anxiety, it's rooted in deeper concerns. You know, where is my place going to be in this age of AI? What you, what's going to happen to my job? You know, will a robot take it? And if I don't have a job, how am I going to pay for my student loans? How am I going to support my family? The point I'm making here is that showing sensitivity to these concerns, to these really basic needs of people is going to have to be essential in doing business in this post-COVID world. And I've said it before, empathy is going to be one of the biggest strategic competitive advantages in this digital world, in this age of AI. And really, we could just call it the age of anxiety over money and more. Empathy is going to be a powerful tool in your tool belt from a relationship standpoint for both marketing and sales. But the good news is that empathy, as I shared in episode number 25, empathy can be learned.